Strong winds over the weekend left crews cleaning up today. Those winds left Gallia Academy Middle School without a portion of the roof. Yes, just wild pictures. And News Channel 3's Alex Jackson spoke with the district superintendent about when class may be back in session. A surprise day off for students as crews work to repair a damaged roof at Galley Academy Middle School. Ripped off during heavy winds Saturday, the school left with no choice but to close down. District Superintendent Craig Wright says one of the main challenges is the roof, wrapped around an exhaust chimney connected to the school's HVAC system. Underneath the damaged roof is an older roof that Wright says once patched should be able to get the school through the remainder of the academic year. The district now evaluating new solutions to get the doors back open. We want to get a crane in so that we can stabilize the top and then do a safe removal from the building. And I feel like once we can establish that, then we can fix the minor things that are done to the roof and get our students back in seat. The superintendent says seeing the damage was devastating, but he is glad no one was hurt. It was heart-wrenching. I mean, you know, it was disappointing. Uh, I was just thankful that we didn't have students or staff in the building at the time. Members of the community can't wait for the school to reopen. Well, I hope it gets open really soon. I hate to see the kids as much as had problems we had with COVID and everything to get back in school and get their education going. The district thankful for all the support poured in from the community. You know, it makes you feel good that your community comes together and rallies for you when you need them. Uh, we like to think that we're there for the community and they were certainly there for us yesterday. Wright says the school will likely not reopen this week, but he is hoping with the added time from next week's scheduled spring break, the school will be able to reopen the following week. Alex Jackson, WSAZ News Channel 3. Now, Wright says if the repairs at Gallia Academy Middle take longer than next week's spring break, they may look into some remote learning options for those students.